what's going on guys it is our last full day here on a spring break vacation so i figured today would be a good day to make a video since it's been like seven months since my last post here on youtube so just wanted to make uh, a couple statements announcements of what's been going on and what's coming up in the future for me so we are currently staying at this cabin here um it's my wife's cousin's cabin up in the mountains hills here of tennessee nice little creek running through the, the backyard here that i'm standing next to got some good rain last night so she's flowing pretty good today um so the reason why it's been so long since I made up my last video was um, right after the, the competition in September, I decided to go through some uh, physical therapy, try and get some of the issues that I've been dealing with worked out. Um, it worked a little bit. I'm still having some issues, but uh, we'll get that figured out um, as while we're moving along, I guess. Um, just a lot of tight muscles in my hips, my low back, that uh, need to work on doing a lot more stretching all the time. So it's something I've been working on and uh, it, it's, it's it's a slow road recovering um, after years of not taking care of that area. So uh, next thing is uh, right before we left on vacation, I signed up for uh, my first competition of this year. So that will be on June 8th in Harbor Beach, Michigan, Battle on the Beach. And uh, the competition is hosted by uh, Nick O'Hare, who has been on the podcast one time before. Um, one of the craziest, strongest, nicest guys that I know in the strongman sport. So excited to uh, do that competition. He did it last year. I don't remember why. I couldn't do it last year. I think we we're probably camping or on vacation or something like that. There's lots of competitions in Michigan this year. Unfortunately, just a lot of them fell at times where we've already had stuff planned for um, months now. This one popped up and uh, I jumped right on board. I was the second person to sign up for it. So um, luckily enough, this is two weeks before we go on a really long camping trip. So. Um, there was another competition that was taking place. Throwdown was taking place while we're on our camping trip. And then uh, there was another one. The competition that I did last year is uh, two weeks after our camping trip. Um, still might do another one in October down in the Detroit area. Um, I like the events for that one as well. So we might get signed up for it bugs are coming out with all the rain um and then the last biggest thing is um i made the decision after um having a, a struggle for the last year or so um to leave redcon one um i still gotta do a couple different things to let them know i'm leaving and uh yeah uh yeah, it is. <clears throat> so, I've already uh, come to terms with them that I I don't know. It's just been a struggle with me for the last year or so. So, and I, I've seen a lot of people going through the same things. Um, they treated me well for a good three years and uh, I'm coming up on uh, four years with them. So, um, you know, if you look at some of these bigger athletes, you know, a lot of them chase contracts and move around whatsoever. Hon honestly, they weren't doing anything to pay my bills or anything like that. Um, I stuck around for a while and uh, there's been some issues lately that, you know, maybe it's just time for me to move on. So nothing against them or anything like that, but um, like I said, they treated me good for three years and uh, it was just time for me to move on. So with that being said, um, I've already started looking around, um, applying for, to some new companies and uh, already got accepted in. And uh, I'm now part of the demo crew with Axe and Sledge. So 
Uh, more on that to come in the future. Um, I guess I'll put a link down below if anybody wants to try it out or look it out, look it over. Um, see my discount code below that. But uh, yeah, I still have a lot of Redcon 1 products to go through. And uh, we'll slowly start the transition over um, as I go through that. So um, I wasn't looking to make a quick change or anything like that. It just kind of happened. So um, yeah, that's all I got. I'm um, looking forward to the uh, the year to come. Uh, I'm going to start doing some training as soon as we get home. Uh, the events have already been posted, but not in the weights. So for Harbor Beach, Battle on the Beach. And uh, looking forward to that. So five events. There's going to be uh, a kettlebell, like a kettlebell toss over bar, kind of like a keg toss over bar. A uh, overhead press medley with a log double dumbbells and a sandbag. A natural stone to shoulder, um, like a grip training feed bag farmer's carry type of walk. <clears throat> it's interesting uh, to see what the weight's on that and how I'm going to train for that. I'm probably going to use some uh, uh, sandbag liners and both sand and train that way. Um, and then the deadlift is going to be a, uh, silver dollar deadlift style. So, yeah, I think I said everything there. Hope y'all, uh, haven't missed me too much and, uh, look forward to some training videos coming out very soon. And maybe I'll talk with Corey. Corey's got some, had some stuff going on, um, this past month. So maybe we'll have to get with him and... <clears throat> do a podcast soon.